All right, here we go again. Thanks, Kevin. So it wasn't rain, it wasn't mm -hmm. hail, wasn't snow either. That storm yesterday brought weather we don't often see on the valley floor, as Kevin mentioned, grapple. Yeah, Action News reporter Alyssa Flores is live near Carruthers, where we're continuing to see the grapple fall this afternoon. Alyssa. Yeah, we are right at 41 in Mountain View in that area. And we just got some video into the Action Newsroom, Action News Newsroom, showing what Kevin described as a mix of grapple and hail. It happened right near this area. And right now we're starting to see the wind pick up. I'll give you a look behind me at that gorgeous rainbow that we're seeing with some storm clouds in the background as well. And like I mentioned, wind picking up with some very, very, very light showers uh, at this point, just a few droplets. What we saw here in the valley yesterday may have looked like snow. It may have even felt icy like snow, but it wasn't. We asked our Action News meteorologist to explain. Streets, backyards, even vineyards covered in white across the valley after the latest winter storm. The white stuff is softer than hail, but not quite snow. What fell from the sky across the valley Wednesday night Grapple. A lot of us across the valley, I know, saw it. People were kind of getting confused between hail and snow, and it's kind of the middle ground between the two. Action News meteorologist Madeline Evans explains the difference. It's a snowflake when it's falling, but then it kind of hits this layer of raindrops that are falling that are really, really cold. So the temperature of those raindrops are usually right around below 32 degrees. So that actually attaches onto the snowflake and kind of creates grapple. And so you kind of get this white pellet like what we saw. It looks a little like styrofoam when it accumulates on the ground and it's essentially like hail. But the biggest difference is hail is a solid pellet of ice with grapple. It's much softer since you have that snowflake within it. White, cold, icy. It was all the same to Nanette Howard and her family in Clovis. The whole yard was just white and I was like, is that snow? Like, am I tripping? Like, this exactly. looks like shaved ice. Like, that's what I said. It. I was like, look, it's a snow cone on the floor. Seven-year-old Nevaeh couldn't wait to build a faux snowman. <laughs> my dad came out and then like my daughter just ran out. No shoes, no nothing. She just went. <laughs> In Fowler, this is insane. The Kasigian family couldn't believe their backyard was blanketed in white. In southeast Fresno, cars covered in grapple. It was coming down quickly at this home in the Riverstone community of Madeira. While the valley didn't see actual snowfall this time around, it's still possible during the next round of wetter winter weather. For anyone who does want to see snow on the valley floor, we have that potential for the next two days. And thanks to all of our Action News viewers who have been sending us all of those weather pictures of rain, of grapple, of snow up in the foothills and mountains. We'd love it if you'd keep sending them to us through social media. Live in Fresno County, Elizabeth Flores, ABC 30 Action News.